here we are. Wildlands playthrough part 56. Uh, when I was making my video yesterday, I uh, lost power. So what had happened was, is we went to this place and meet at the RV, and we get there and there's a dead body, and it's one of the rebel leaders. We get a hold of Bowman, we start talking to her, and all of a sudden we get cut off. Or no, maybe that was the other mission. The one with, uh... But anyway, so we end up having to meet Bowman here at this uh, town. And so, basically what's going to happen is is that we're going to get a surprise once we go through this uh, cutscene. So, don't be afraid of that. The problem was is that... Uh, and not that I'm a wimp, but my difficulty was set on extreme. So I'm just like getting almost one-shotted every single time. <laughs> but, so I was, you know, I'd get down, my guys would get me up, and then I'm trying, you have to get over to that mausoleum over there. And you have like ten minutes to get over there. <laughs> and it was just like, I'd get almost there, almost there, almost there. And then I lose power. And I'm like, no. So that's why we're, you're not going to be able to see the very first part of me doing this mission was where I go find the dead body. So just to give you a heads up on all that. So basically what we're going to do is we're going to uh, get in here. And I'm going to get this vehicle ready to go. Hang on, I'll drive. Oh, wait a minute. Nah, we should be fine with this one. I said I could get the armored one, because the other, you'll, you'll see what's going to happen. I, I don't want to spoil too much for you. I just want to get this set up. And it's getting dark, so this is going to be even better. Okay. You'll notice the little green dots all over the town here. Yeah, get ready. Bowman. <clears throat> Back Atari. What about him? He turned on us. Mm-hmm. He was sent here as a diversion. Diversion from what? Sueño. The rebels found out where he is. Get to the mausoleum. I'll meet you there. Nomad? You understand what this means, right? Mm-hmm. From here on out, Pakatari and the Rebels are no longer our allies. Yep. That means we lose all our special abilities from them. So we can't call in guns for hire, we can't call in diversions, we can't call in spotting, we can't call in our mortars, we can't call in our vehicles. We are on our own. Rebel hostiles. We are on our own. From here on out. Alright, so I turned down the difficulty just because I want to complete the mission. They were just tearing me up. I don't want to try to kill the rebels, but they're making it where we have to. Yep, see you at so now we got red, green, and purple, all of our enemies. Hola, camarada. Pack, what the hell are you trying to do? Same thing as you, amigo. Doing what's right for my country. El mm -hmm. sueño will die on Bolivian soil. My people must know. The governments must know. The other cartels must know. The rebels. Are not slaves for the Americans. We are strong on our own. That way you can ah! goodness. Oh no. Oh no. We're stuck. But ideals do not feed people. Oh. Ideals do not build armies. Ideals do not take down corrupt governments. Neither does getting your people killed. My people know that if they die today, they will return tomorrow at 
That's cool. Even though I wanted that minigun. I better turn this on, make it a little easier to see here. Oh God! <laughs> Alright, there you go. Oop. So now you know the story of what happened to us. Oh, here we go. Seen us. Uh, this little Jeep just ain't <laughs> having it. I forgot this was a turn. Ah, look out, look out, look out, look out. Hope I'm recording this. <laughs> yeah, I'm recording. Okay. I was like, oh man. Yeah, see, now I can see the little dots all over. That LT's getting away. I don't care about the LT. Alright, we go. Shoot down that helicopter. of this for a second. Yep, there's some more right up the road here. Ready? Open fire. Target. Opening fire. That's one less bad guy. Alright, let's switch vehicles here. Let's go. Let's roll. Oh, oh. Alright, this is where we gotta get out now. Ah, get out. What am I stuck? Stuck. There we go. They're coming right at us. What's the word, boss? Bird is the word. That's what it is. They are taking fire from cartel Sicarios. Fucking unit. Hold on. Copter, get down. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. Shit balls. Get ready. Fire. Copy that. Chopper, down, down. I understand there's a chopper, but I must take care of chopper. Okay, okay. 
take it anymore. Eyes up. Let's get back to work. Taking fire from Cartel Sicarios. Fucking Unidad, too. Is there anybody in Bolivia who ain't shooting at us? Yeah, Bowman, so far. Come on, get up here. You guys are just letting them walk up on me. Because I don't know why you guys are just hanging down there. You're not protecting your boss. Oop. Oh my god. Can't control my gun here. Oh, goodness. I got 57 seconds to get up here, boys. Alright, let's go. We're clear on this side. <laughs> Rally up, people. Roger, moving. Here we go. your fucking hands now I would but unfortunately my hands are full at the moment where is he I want to see the big bad horseman put it down as you wish adios senor Katari Ooh. you have five seconds to get on your knees and interlace your fingers before I put a hollow point through your forehead you're going to want to answer your phone officer Bowman mm-hmm <laughs> I am asking you that you... Sir. <laughs> yes, I understand. Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> Fuck you! Fuck! Bowman, what is it? Bowman. He got full immunity. He got... He made a deal and he got... A deal with Fuck. who? Who do you think? The DOJ! Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. You're not he saying... He offered up the heads of four other cartels, plus three terror groups that traffic heroin. His competition. How is this possible? As I told you, if you have power, everything else follows. Mm-hmm. <laughs> If you don't mind, Senora Bowman, 
the things that yesterday you were my adversary. Today you are nothing but my chauffeur. It's gonna go down. I'm sorry. Bowman, no! Oh! That's the end of El Sueño. And Bowman, I believe. Yeah, pity. I really wanted to fight the guy. <laughs> Watching this, that means I have executed El Sueño. I'm certain that people will think I went crazy, that I did it out of emotion, that I broke. Fuck them. They're wrong. I knew exactly what I was doing. Hmm. Piece of shit. Monster. Tortured my friend. Killed him. Decapitated my partner. Massacred thousands. He gets to walk? Uh, sorry, but not on my fucking watch. Given what El Sueño knew about Ricky Sandoval, he would have been unstoppable. Trivia question. What happens when you give immunity to a drug lord? Ding, ding, ding. You get a dictator. Taking out a drug lord is one thing. But stopping a dictator? You need a few more than four operators for that. My career, my freedom, my life is not worth more than the people of South America. Obviously, not everyone agrees. Which is why I'm most likely now in a federal correctional institute, getting three hots in a cot for the next 45 to life for murder. By now, the CIA has probably released an official statement saying the case officer in question is no longer employed by this agency uh -huh. and in direct opposition to her superiors. Her actions have caused great harm to the continued efforts of the intelligence community here and abroad. And guess what? They're right. I would have done the same thing as them. No hard feelings there. I just hope they don't leave Bolivia. Without Pakatari, the rebellion will tear itself apart with infighting. Unidad will make a deal with the next criminal organization that comes along. And the remains of Santa Blanca will split off and form new mini cartels. All those shitty names like Nueva Frontera Cartel, <laughs> Barrio Familia, and Los Hijos del Sueño. How do you know? <laughs> killing each other for that coca. I wonder, if God knew all the destruction that this little leaf would bring, would she have still created it? Or maybe that's exactly why she did. Hmm. I don't even know anymore. But it's no longer my question to answer. So I leave you with this. In the dying words of Augustus, founder and first emperor of the Roman Empire, have I played the part well? Then applaud as I exit. Hmm. Bowman out. What a way to end it. Or is it the end? Dun dun dun. Yeah, we don't need to see all those. Well, there we go, folks. I think we've got the, uh, main part of it done. Now there is a DLC that allows us to um, play uh, the Fallen Ghosts thing. Ah, complete 100% to unlock the new ending. Yeah, see. So there is a little bit more we can do. We still have that right there. Oh, wait a minute there. There's another. Okay, well that's weird to do that one when we already done killed the main guy. But I guess that's what we'll be doing. El Sueño wants to meet. So this maybe is gonna be weird. Maybe he wants to negotiate. Maybe he wants to kill you. Either way, watch your ass. Okay, well, that's that then. Can we get up in there? Where's the nearest safe house? I guess over here would be 
get him in a fight. No. Oh, we get our stuff back now. I asked the rebels to do a recon of the area. Copy. We're laying in at locations now. Yet, I see his little blip. He must be on the inside. I mean, can I open this up and just take care of these guys in here? Nope. Can't. Well, that stinks. Alrighty. Well then. this because I'm hunted I asked the rebels to recon the area for us Here. Roger let me get in position let me get a good sight line let you do this let you do that target marked target marked we're good we're good got it Down. all right good that's what I needed to get out of that hunted status so I can get up here see what's going on here alrighty <laughs> it's the Tom and Jerry show. There we go, folks. Tell you what, we'll end it on this one and then uh, we'll pick up the other stuff. What a what a nightmare. Anyway, thanks for sticking with it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting this, the channel here. Mm, excuse me. And we'll catch you in the next one.